The next question is 13 subdivision 1. The question is there is one sphere, inside there is one cylinder. The radius of the sphere is given 9 centimeters. Radius of the sphere is given 9 centimeters. You have to find out the height of the cylinder, what can be inscribed in this sphere so that the volume of the cylinder is maximum. You have to find out the volume of the cylinder, uh, height of the cylinder for which the volume of the cylinder is maximum. That is the question. Let us assume the height of the cylinder as 2h and the radius of this cylinder as r so that this total length comes to r. You are thinking why I have taken 2h here. Calculation will be easy, that's why I have taken 2h. Because this is 2r is coming here. 2 times 9 is coming here. That's why 2 times h I have used here so that the calculation comes simple. So, this is one right angle triangle. I will use the property, uh, this Pythagoras theorem that is 2r whole square plus 2h whole square is equal to 2 into 9 whole square. This square plus this square is equal to this square. 2 will cancel, 2 square will cancel throughout. That's why I have taken 2h here instead of h. That gives r square plus h square is equal to 81. This is the equation 1. This is the known condition. You have to use this to find out the height of the cylinder so that the volume of this cylinder is maximum. Volume of the cylinder formula formula of volume of cylinder is how much? Area of base into height pi r square h volume of cylinder is pi r square h and h is 2h here so pi r square 2h now volume function is containing two variables r and h you have to eliminate one variable from here so that we can find the derivative which one will be easy that you have to replace here if you want to replace h then square root will come because h square value is here h value will be square root of something but if we replace r square that will be simple so in this case I will replace r square from equation 1 that gives v is equal to 2 pi h as it is r square value from this equation is coming 81 minus h square 81 minus h square this has come by equation 1 simple calculation you can easily check 2 pi will remain as it is h I will multiply inside 81h minus h cube this is your volume function and when this is maximum that you have to find out let's find derivative two times dv by dh here the variable is h with respect to h i am finding the derivative dv by dh is equal to 2 pi as it is derivative of h is 1 with respect to h derivative of h with respect to h is 1 1 into 81 is 81 minus 3h square and second derivative d2v dh2 is equal to 2 pi as it is derivative of 81 constant is 0 minus 3 to the 6 h height is positive quantity or negative quantity height cannot be negative positive quantity so minus of positive quantity is negative the value is coming less than 0 this is negative quantity second derivative I have got less than 0 now you have to make first derivative 0 now dv by dh is equal to 0 implies this is the value something into something is equal to 0. This is constant. This cannot be 0. So this has to be 0. Implies 81 minus 3a square is equal to 0. That gives 3a square is equal to 81. h square is equal to divide by 3, 27. h is equal to square root of 27. 27 is 3 into 9, 3 root 3. Unit was given, I think, centimeters. So this will be centimeters. Your question is height. In the figure the height is 2h. I have got the value of h. So 2h will be how much? That implies 2h is equal to 6 root 3 
centimeters. Question was find the height of the cylinder so that the volume of the cylinder is maximum. Already second derivative less than zero is maximum. Corresponding height value is six root three centimeter. Therefore, V is maximum when height is equal to six root three centimeter. So this is the method to solve this type of problems.